Active deterrence is about making your video surveillance system noticeable and also prevent any kind of crime that can happen on a premise. When you think about it, your camera acts as a first line of defense when it comes to security. So if you have a camera installed on your residential home and a thief comes by and he sees it, well, chances are he's going to try another home instead of yours because he saw the cameras. But when we're talking about larger premises, such as parking lots or construction sites, it's not as easy as having one camera to cover something, right? You have a big video surveillance systems, but again, thieves can act in the shadows. So if they don't see the cameras, they don't think they're caught, so there will be damage. That's where active deterrence comes into play, and you can see it as a second line of defense to your video surveillance system. So today we're gonna see what is active deterrence, the, the technology, how to improve it, and all of that by using the X series from GSD Group, because this camera doesn't only have motion detection, but it's using AI, such as human detection, vehicle detections, all that kind of stuff. And this is required when we're talking about active deterrence because you don't want any false alarm. Let's get to it. All right, as I mentioned, we're using the X series from GSD Group. We have their turret right here. So what is active deterrence? I'm gonna show you a quick example right now. So active deterrence is again a second line of defense. So when the thief comes on a premise, let's say a parking lot, and tries to steal a car, the AI does his human detection that is scheduled maybe during the night. And as soon as he comes in front of this camera that covers a wide angle, well, it will trigger the camera. And again, as I just shown, you will hear a siren and you will see lights. So that's what I meant by being noticeable. Like the thief will hear, hear a siren, see the light, he knows he's on camera. So right at this moment, it prevents any damage to happen to your car. That's why you need specific AI because when we're talking about motion detection, as you know, I'm pretty sure you've seen that before, you have to kind of create a grid of pixel on your screen and if it's an animal, if it's wind uh, with leaves, it will trigger the alarm. And you don't want to have the lights and the siren go on every time you, you have an event. So it's important to use the right type of camera for these types of actions. Now, this is globally how active deterrence work, but how can you actually improve it? And this is where GSD Group kind of uh, reach out to us and show this new technology. So we're looking at their active speaker. This is a pre-amplified analog speaker. So it's a nice add-on to your camera. That means that the siren you heard, it was pretty low right now, right? We are in the studio. We don't want to make a lot of noise. So we lower it down. But if again, you're covering a parking lot, you need to cover a lot of space. So this speaker is 105 decibels. Believe me when I say it's loud. So we're gonna connect it to the camera and that's why this solution is so great. You only need your camera to power up the speaker. So you will be using an RCA adapter and a 12 volt DC adapter that comes with the active speaker from GSD Group and it's super easy to use. So it's part of the package. Here we have the RCA connector. So you would take your cables from your camera. So you take your audio out, you put it inside right there, and you take the audio from your speaker. So I'll put it closer to me, it will be easier to do. Uh, and you connect it to the camera itself. So plug it in, this is done. And now we will power up the speaker by using the power from the camera. So this is a PoE camera, it's an IP camera. So power over internet gives power to the camera. And with this, it will also give power to the speaker. So through the 12 volt DC adapter. So I put it in, there we go. And a good way to know it's working, you hear a little noise inside the speaker, but also you see a green light appearing on this cable. So that means that your speaker is powered up. So now the siren you just heard will be played through the speaker. I'm gonna show you again. Now, I, I lower a little bit the sound, so it's not that bad, right? <laughs> but you see that already 
the noticeable aspect is even more important here. And that's not only this, the, the, the only thing you can do with this speaker. So by using either the NVR, the VMS, or even the mobile application, so the Smart Guardian application from GSD, you can do voice prompts. So using voice prompt is either by a keyboard or you're importing file on your VMS and VR mobile app, and you're able to put sounds inside the camera that will play through the speaker. That means that if you're securing a parking lot, you can enter a sentence like police is coming. So this way, as soon as the event is triggered, it will blast through the speaker and the thief will, I'm pretty sure they will, <laughs> they will run away by hearing this. So I'm gonna show you just a quick example of what I mean by voice, voice prompts. Again, it's, it's the same thing. So it will play instead of the siren on you, or you can play it with the siren. So you hear the siren and you will also hear the voice prompt. So you set it up again. It works in sync with AI. So as soon as there's a human detection, vehicle detection, as I mentioned, a lot of things, it will trigger that way. Like and subscribe. Now that this mentioned, are you subscribed to our channel? It's helped us a lot to create new videos. And if you reach this moment of the video, I'm pretty sure you like it, right? So you should like and subscribe. So it help us grow our channel and make more content like this. Let's get back to the video. So we've just shown the voice prompt. Another thing you can do that is really nice is by using the Smart Guardian app from GSD that you can download either on the Play Store, on the Apple Store, is you can talk through the app and it will be directed and blasted through the speaker itself. So if you're working with a security that is monitoring your site or even a monitoring central alarm station, well, as soon as they receive an event from the camera, they're able to communicate with the individual that is on the premise to tell him to go away or that the police is coming. As a quick example, I'm gonna show you. So download the Smart Guardian app, click on the app itself. Then you have connected your surveillance solution to the app by scanning the QR code. You click on the camera and you click on the microphone. So it's as easy as saying hello. Police is coming. A little bit of feedback, it's a small studio, but you get the idea. With all that said, what happens on a real life scenario? So I explain your situation, but let's see in application how it actually goes. So you have your camera, you have your own, and you are a monitoring station. So looking at a site and you receive an alarm. So you hear the horn going off and also, so it's not motion, my mistake, it's human detection. So I need to show my face. The sound goes off, you open your application, so the Smart Guardian, and there you have notifications. So this is the dots you see on the top left. So the notification appears on your screen. You're able to click on it and see exactly what happened. So with the AI filter, as we see here, it was a human detection. So I can click and go see the playback of what happened on the setup or I can click and also go to the live situation. So to see, for example, here, you would see my hand. So the live situation of who is on the premise. And from there, I can use the speaker to tell to the intruder to get out and that the police is coming, for example. So I'm gonna do that right away. So you click on the microphone again. Police. <laughs> And same situation, a lot of feedback. In addition to all this, by monitoring a huge premise that you, with using the speaker, using the camera, using the VMS, well, you can also disarm your system. So this can be really helpful because as you see, it creates light, it creates sound. So during the day, it's not necessarily what you want. So if you're not working on a schedule and you work with your cameras, if you click on the shield below, so right here, and you put on the X, so that means that it is disarmed. So if it sees humans, if it sees any kind of motion, it will not trigger. So again, really helpful when you have a lot of deterrence like this solution from GSD Group. And as easy as you disarm it, you just click to arm it and then you would hear again the big siren that comes from this horn. So I will click on it and now it is armed. And as you can see, I show my face. And as simple as that. So disarm, arm, you're one click away from arming your system. 
and making sure that the deterrence factor is present on the premise. Again, super easy to install and keep in mind that this speaker also work with regular cameras. So if you have an audio out, that's all you need to do the connection with your speaker and you will be able to speak through it and make your sirens go through the speaker right there. Again, this is a complete solution. We have the noticeable aspect with the lights from the camera. You also have a two-way audio because you have a microphone inside the camera, so you hear what's happening and you blast through the speaker for your audio output, which kind of prevent any action to happen. So again, this can be applicable to many scenarios. All you need to do is really do uh, your due diligence in making sure that your AI is properly set up. The volume is also set up for your own speaker. And this is kind of a mix between video and alarm solutions. So it helps you cover a lot of aspect when it comes to security. So if you're on the fence of getting an active deterrence because you're, you're not really sure how to set it up, let us know in the comment below. We'll make a video about how to properly set up your AI and how to also activate your active deterrence to make sure that your premise is secure. All right, guys, if you'd like this video, you like this camera, you like the speaker, you want this solution for you, visit gsdgroup.ca. We're gonna put everything in the description below so you'll be able to find these product and order them right now. Have a good one.